What is up my crazy subscriber, this is Joe King Jones 84 and today people I want to talk about the Division 2 trailer. Now if you guys have not known yet, there has been confirmation that the Division 2 is pretty much coming soon and also the first gameplay reveal will be shown at E3 this year. So uh, I'm pretty much excited for the game, you know I played the first one and it is pretty much my longest running series here in this channel it has over 80 episodes in total and uh, it was pretty much fun to do I mostly play the dark zone by the way and uh, no PvP so far so uh, I might actually try out PvP in the summer but let's see you know what the division 2 has in hold for us hopefully a lot of exciting things so anyways today I want to talk about how the trailer of the division 2 might be a lot of uh, you know it, it might post up a lot of misleading things if you guys have never seen the division 1 trailer compared to the regular game a lot of things have changed you know since like the trailer because the division didn't release like two years or one year after the trailer and uh, man the game was different the menu was different even uh, you know there was a part of the video of the trailer where they showed the enemies shooting you rockets there was no rockets in the game in the whole like in the whole time. The only time there was a little bit of explosions when you shoot a grenade launcher, and that's about it, and throw grenades. But never, ever, ever, ever have I ever experienced you know some rocket launchers in the dark zone or any other places in the game. So that is quite questionable there. Like what's going on here? So the rockets were not there. Even the first mission in the trailer was not even in the full game release. You had to go through the outside of the police station. Also, you can shoot through the wood, which is not possible in the full game. Uh, there was a a little ability where they showed you a drone and I was thinking like that ability never made it to the final game it might be in the next game hopefully and maybe it will be even stronger because uh, you know it is a flying turret so uh, maybe it will be a great support uh, ability so a lot of the things in the first shutter was not even in the you know in the final release day so what I'm trying to say tell you guys here is that do not get mad when the division 2 trailer drops because a lot of the things there are gonna be super misleading and I know some of you guys are gonna take it to heart like saying like oh this game now sucks because the full game release was not the exact thing as the trailer and to be honest I was a little bit upset about the division but when you get more into it and more into the role play you pretty much get a lot of fun out of it which I did so um, I just want you guys to keep an eye on that and you know, just be aware of some of the biggest changes within the final game and the trailer and you'll see the differences once the game comes out I'll probably do like a compare review thing like uh, what I said like both videos aside and you'll see the you know the different graphics and the different style they used to have so um, a lot of things change I know people are gonna say like oh Joe it's just a beta no, the trailer is just a beta it comes out in E3 the game came out two years later after that so like it's the beta stage yeah I understand that but uh, you know over the years a lot of people get mad over the trailer not being the real thing and I did get mad about also about Ghost Recon Wildlands too because the final product was not the same thing as the trailer so that's what Ubisoft tends to do you know Ubisoft never changes they always gonna be uploading this you know badassery and explosions everywhere kind of trailer and then in the final product it's not the same thing so uh, that's all I want to talk about today guys just check out the Division 1 trailer compared to the final game and you'll see the biggest difference and pretty much is, that's something you want to expect in Division 2 to not get too excited because the final trailer might not even be the final product so that is it guys it's just a quick talk I just want to talk about the Division 2 I'm excited for that game I might talk about you know future ideas about the Division 2 you know what do I want in the game and all and what changes do I want in the game too so that is it make sure you subscribe for more guys want to see more commentary and topics